Hey y'all, what's up? Hope you guys are having a great day. Please leave your prayer request in the bottom. My email will be in the description box. So, um, something big and major happened in Texas. There are rumors swirling about what this could have been. Some people say it's a Russian attack. Some people say it's a cyber attack. Um, well, I will say this. It was an oil pipe. And those oil pipes, you know, it, it somehow it burst. So some, something, something happened to make it explode up out of the ground. And we have had oil burning for over an hour. By the time this video uploads, it'll probably be closer to like an hour and a half, maybe two hours, depending on how slow my internet wants to be. But, you know, this is just another sign that we are going home. It's just another sign that everything is converging. Um, and we also had more earthquakes in California. Guys, things are moving. Things are shifting. And um, last night, I'm telling you, some something was off last night. Um, my dogs, my dogs could not sleep. They were barking all throughout the night. I had to let them out literally every 10 minutes. I got little to no sleep. It was like, oh my goodness. It, it was so insane. Like, my dogs have never acted this way. So, I know that something's wrong. And the air and everything just kind of felt different last night. And this morning... I seen this little, it was almost like a, it was like a white clear balloon and I tried to get video of it, but I guess because it was almost like an, I guess they call it an opaque or a clear color or whatever. Um, I really couldn't actually take video of it, so to speak, because it just blended in with the sky, but I could see it with my naked eye and it was just it was just really crazy and interesting to watch. Um, but you know what? No matter what goes on, we have got to keep our eyes on Jesus. We know we are at the end. We know we are in the final moment. We know that God's on the throne. We know that Jesus is coming to get us. We have nothing to fear for God is with us. God did not give us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and of sound mind. And I did not come on here to tell you this information to scare you. But it is a warning. And if you are not found in Jesus, if you reject the blood, or reject the free gift of salvation, if you're on that fence, this should scare you. I'm not going to lie, but if you are founded in Jesus, I'm telling you, this should excite you because this is another sign that we are going home. Everything must be set up for the fall of America and the rise of the Antichrist. The seven years of tribulation is at the door. We're in the way. And the Holy Spirit's confirmed that we are in the way. And I noticed somebody uh, in my comment section said, Have to test the spirits. I test the spirit. I know and I trust that what God has shown me and confirmed over and over again, if it wasn't so, I wouldn't be bringing it to you. And I wouldn't be saying that this is from the Lord. This is biblical. I backed it up with scripture and I have talked with other brothers and sisters in Christ. So go ahead. If you want to test the spirits, please. Yes. Test the spirits. Yes. Please take it to God. Take it to the Lord in prayer. Anything that I bring to you. This isn't the time to be playing games. This isn't the time to be, um, I don't even know what the word is. But I'm telling you, I'm telling you, 
this is another sign that we are going home and I will link in the description box uh, what's going on in Texas right now guys this is I will tell you this is bad bad but it's good news for us because it means we're going home soon it's just another sign eyes on Jesus oh my goodness eyes on Jesus he is our everything thank you Jesus all glory and praise belongs to him all right well I'm gonna get off here upload this video hope you guys have a great day bye y'all